Hello, friends. Welcome back to another episode of Battletech Rogue Tech. And there is not much here for us in the terms of uh, missions. And we've got five days. Uh, I think what we're going to do is we're going to run through the financial report. And we're going to see if we can't get some good randomized missions. If not, we're gonna pick another planet and we're going to head on off or we'll stay here and check them out. Oh, we have a nice, uh, we've got a nice list here. Another blackout. That sounds interesting. A two, two skull? I think we'll do that. So let's get our mechs repaired. Let's see. No techs, no mechs. All right. Okay. The question is do we want to go broke? Do we want to leave it to Darius? No, I don't think that's good. All right, let's give everyone bonuses. I mean, we're going to be broke. Morale goes up by 20. That's great. And a plus four tech boost. So that's good. All right. Let's get the Kintaro out and let's go make some money. <laughs> now that we're nice and broke, let's check what we can do here. Let's see, we're gonna take tactics six, here, tactics six here for a call chat bonus. We're gonna have gunnery seven and tactics six here. Same thing for witness. And paradise will get gunnery seven, but he'll have to wait on tactics six. He's not quite there yet. All right, let's get into the command center. And we've got a battle in the Badlands. Let's go for it. Oof. Is this a money grab? The money is a lot better than the salvage on this. I think that's what we're going for. So we'll take one of six and almost six and a half hundred thousand sea bills. That works for me. Let's go. So we'll get in there, smash a lance, get back out again and call it a day. Well, I don't, I don't think we'll, hopefully we don't have too much on the board that is, oh my God, I gotta have it. That's gonna hurt. <laughs> That's going to be the feels. But, you know, we just dropped a million C-bills making everybody happy. And that's all we that's all we got. So we this this one mission as long as we can keep the repair costs to a minimum will actually pay for that whole escapade and keep us in good standing for the next financial report. So let's go. All right, we're seeing one lance, not far away. All right, what have we got? Uh, we want high ground. Copy that. Hundred percent, we want high ground here. All right, so we got an urban mech, a um, special edition, and we got a strider, and then a grim reaper. On the move. All right, let's get into combat. What can I do for you? 
So we take the one, give us the cover, an arrow for, okay, this guy's got to go. This guy has got to go. Alright, there's a one, catapult 1R. Pretty primitive catapult. And we're definitely going rate of fire on Irby here. Alright, that must have been the Grim Reaper coming in. Alarm 20, ER PPC, ER small laser, and something in energy. Alright, let's get ourselves lined up on Irby here. Now let's see if we can't take out that arm. Good. <laughs> Good. No more fast cam for Irby. <laughs> Mines are pretty much the bane of my existence. <laughs> you have orders? All right, we're going to come down here. Now we are a little hot. We're not going to fire the narc. He's got about 50 odd. And I think we can hold off on both lasers here. And we're going to go right for center torso. There we go. Irby's down. Just the way I like it. Alright, we're going to stay to the high ground. And we'll go after the strider next. All right, let's bring it over here. Okay, we're grinding through him. I definitely have to watch out for that catapult. It's going to hurt. All right, and we can't do anything here. We're just way too hot. We're already overheated. We are in the danger of dealing with an ammo explosion right now. Question is, do we switch targets? Uh, no. We don't switch targets. We're going with the same guy we've been going with. We may have to switch over to that Green Reaper, Reaper though. Problem is, we're just way too hot right now. Keep sprinting along the top. Okay, there we go. Do we have a good shot here? Oh, we're not going rate of fire. We have to go accuracy here. Firing all yeah, that's a solid hit. Yes, Commander. Roger. Full speed. Now, what can we do here? We can't do anything. So we're going to go vigilance here. And then just vent the heat and hopefully the catapult will try to shoot somebody else or better yet not be able to fire at all all right we're moving over let's go uh, let's not fire the LRMs here. Over the red line. Damn it. Commander. Pedal to the metal. 
I really need them to stop shooting my Kentaro right now. Alright, let's get this guy off the board. I mean, I'm really not worried about it, but... Alright, he hasn't shut down, and we haven't triggered an ammo explosion yet. So let's give the catapult something else to think about right now. Like his own survival. Alright, so let's take the ER mediums off. And shoot back there. All right, we're under the heat threshold again. That's just... That was a heavy hit, Commander. All right. Yes, Commander. Can we get a good... There we go. That's a, that's a proper line of sight here. Can we go rate a fire here? No. Too hot. All right. So the only shots that he has are up there. Let's see. Is this what we want? This could be what we want. And then we'll take... Lay me on the gladiator. Waiting for orders. Moving fast. Right, Commander. That, that wasn't what we wanted to do. Is that more heat? No, that's just damage at this point. Okay. Maintain high ground here. We still can't afford to go. Uh, rate of fire on him. But at least we can get uh, Paradise back into the fray and we can get some heat on the Grim Reaper. All right, there we go. That thing was annoying. There we go. Solid back strike. Oh, I see you. We can't get into his back. We can only get into his side. But we can still light him up. There's the other side. Alright, looks like we got a head hit on him. Move and shoot. Got him stressed. That's a back strike. And this is going to be a back strike. And we're going all in here. All right, we're starting to cook him. There we go. 
What are you going to do? Not much. Where, where, did, uh, where did he go? Oh, there you are. Yeah, let's just shoot from here. There he goes. Perfect. There's a full one on the uh, the board. All right, so let's see. Fair amount of experience for everybody. We've got the full Grim Reaper on the board. Arm 20, C3, Core 275. I believe that is what we are taking here. Oh. I think it's, it's no, it's the double heat sink kit. It's got to be the double heat sink kit. And we've got to put it on our um, Kintaro. We're not keeping that. We're not keeping this and we're not keeping those now it's just a, it was a little bit of salvage it wasn't great but it's what we have to do so where we need to be and what we need to get to well the first thing we need to do is we need to get double heat sinks onto the Kentaro it does run a little bit hot Minor repairs are good. So, let's see. Uh, we're waiting. Up. I should have set that up first. All right. Kintaro refit. Yeah. Oh, Kintaro has a double heat sink kit. Yikes. Let's see. You know, we're dropping the narc. We're going to drop the narc, which gives us four tons. And now we cannot put this, but we can put the MML 10 in. And uh, let's look at uh, first heat. Uh, heat sinks. Heat, no, no, no. Uh, heat sink. That's cores, heat sinks, double heat sink kit. I don't have any double heat sinks. Okay. All right, let's look at missile ammo. We have Thunder, we have Swarm, we have Artemis, we have Tandem. All right, let's drop these guys and we're going to put in a double bin here. Now we're up to 16 missiles. Do we have another MML? No, we have MRMs, and we have... Oh, we dropped this one. We're going to put the Holly on here for the increased accuracy. And then... Let's see. Artemis. Let's get Artemis going. Let's see. Do we, what else do we have? We have clan sensors, we have recon sensors. Let's see, are these basically the same? Mm. Recon sensors, we're gonna take the gunnery support B. Okay. 
unfortunate we don't have double heat sinks. Now, what we need is... I think we're going to have to put case in here. So we drop a case... We're going to drop advanced optics. And then let's get some ammo going. We need LRM ammo. We're going to take Artemis, Artemis. And we're going to take a half a ton of, I think we're going to take another half a ton of Inferno. Or no, we're going to take a half a ton of armor. That's where we're going here. Max that out. Get a little bit more on the legs, a little bit more on the arms. Now, I think that's going to be a better build for us. This way we have a little more long range and then we can get get up get in up close and we can work on overheats we can do all kinds of other things now i'm thinking about it i'm wondering if it's not better to we'll drop that and we'll use the artemis and we can drop this Let's just totally max out armor here. All right, and we have we actually have a ton remaining. What do we have? What do we have? Do a coolant flush? This could be in, this could be interesting to help us flush out that one, but I don't know if it's something that we really need. Uh, we have a support hard point. Actually, we have two of them. We could do AMS here. Be happier with laser AMS, but we put it in AMS and. We'll shave that half a ton off the legs, I guess. Go to 110. And then we'll drop this down. There we go. And then we'll get the AMS ammo. Which is probably, this is probably a bad idea, but hey, why not? All right, so that gives us that gives us a little bit. I think we're much better now with the Kintaro. So we're going to get the build on that. We'll have two days for the financial report. That's fair. All right. Now, let's get that advanced, and we'll see how it works. Oh, what are we looking at here for missions now? We have the blackout, we've got a tag team. Darius units, huh? Darius, what are you up to, boy? No. That was probably a poor choice of words. All right. Now well, let's go in. Ooh, that's a lot of salvage, and I like it. All right, here we go. Let's get in there and get it done. So. 
we have the LRMs out of the MML and the and SRMs out of everything. I think ideally we get another MML launcher and we're able to stack that onto the Kintaro and then just go full bore with both of them. But let's um, let's get one first. At the end, the MML is going to be nice. Going to be very nice to have. Going to be very nice to have. All right. No, it looks like if this works like the last one, it's basically going get ambushed by pirates, find something else, get ambushed again, and come back with all the salvage in the world. All right. Well, we've got some uh, assistance here in the form of some tanks. And a little VTOL. Not too terribly thrilled about that guy. Okay. It looks like we've got quite a few sites here that we've got to look at. I think we're going to have more more than one encounter here. We have any moving to position. All right. All right, we can't take any shots Sorry. yet. On my way. Let's get nice and evasive. I hear you. Got it. Max speed, no shooting. All right, that's Ballistic there. Standing by. On the move. Uh, point defense. There's the quad gun. Let's try to get this guy down. We've got him critical now. Awaiting orders. Okay. Uh, I don't really like this. I think we're going to save the inferno. Uh, no, let's go. We gotta fire. Let's fire everything here. Let's get rid of it. Let's get rid of it. All right. So, where do where are we at? All right. Worm. Well, that one's smoking. Dumper artillery. All right, that one's down. Okay, so I guess we just have to get rid of all four turrets. And what's next? 
These are actually kind of interesting. Right, here we go. Do we have a better shot on the other one? No, not really. Give them everything I've got. How might I help? Should be there in a jiff. Firing. Waiting on you, Commander. Right, Commander. All right. Tell me what to do. All right, we got into a structure. Oh, where do we go to after this? All right, let's get warm up in here. Neither one of these hit chances are very good. All right. All right, we've got ECM all over the place right now. All right, there goes that one. Okay, this is a good hit chance. Can we get another one? Alright, let's go back to accuracy on this one. Into his structure, which is good. Now let's see where our boy Worm can do us. Alright, there we go. Another turret down. And there it goes completely. Follow the trail. Okay, where's our trail go? All right, here we go. What have we got here? All right, what just dropped? Let's see, bandit hovercraft, a bombard, gunship, and the yellow jacket. We'll go. Let's get cover going. The bombard is probably going to be our first target. Depending on how things shape up. And I don't really have good hit chances on it. We don't have good hit chances on uh, anybody right now. All right, let's go for this guy. Yes, Commander. Since it's what we got. All right. Hopefully we can take something down. Negative damage. Repeat. Negative damage. Yeah, that bombard double AC twenty that really concerns me. I actually really want to get him off the board really fast. That's so much pinpoint damage. All right, there we go. That's a hit chance and a half. All right, 
let's get this guy. Okay, one down. All right. You're down. Now. The concern here. That was the concern. All right, he can run. I'm perfectly fine with him going all the way out there. All right, so it looks like we have some turrets helping us. Can we fire anything right now? No. What's up, huh? All right, we can shoot with the marshal. And we will. All right, there's some damage out. That's what we needed right there. Okay, let's go. Let's do it. There we go. Oh, plasma can't. We needed that plasma off the board. We needed that plasma off the board in a big way. All right, we're going to go rate of fire here. Try to take this guy off. Big hit, but not big enough. So he's trying to move now. We'll find out where he's going to head off to. And then we can find out where the bombard is going. Hopefully he was shooting the turrets. If he wants to shoot turrets, I can be happy with that all day long. All right, who's next? Okay, bandit. Reading on you, Commander. Yeah, we're just cooling off here. All right, so we go SRM here. Better hit chance. Throw up some heat. Let him drive through that. Let's see, it's the right side that's open. Can we get to it? We cannot. We're going to go accuracy here. I was hoping to maybe get the spread on the snub onto that right side. We can take his burn damage. Fine with that. All right, good. Keep shoot. Keep shooting those, man. He can seriously shoot every. Oh, there goes. There goes the tank. All right. Looks like one of them is jammed. All right, there's a clear hit chance. And we go rate right of fire here. We need maximum effectiveness right now. All 
All right, let's do it. Nice. Getting him toasty. And we got a structure open too. That's great. All right, what if we? Yep. All right, he did not hit anybody we didn't want him to hit. Good. And he is running that red line right now, which means he's not moving, which gives us better hit chances and a better chance to spike his heat right to the moon. We can't fire. Too much fire. But we can bring in with this guy now. Let's go vigilance, and we'll stop here. We had to, we have to get through the flames. We just can't engage him where he is right now. This is our problem. Our this area is so well constricted that we just can't engage. Fortunately, he was jammed for a little while on that second auto cannon. All right. And we can't get. Oh, we can't get over there. All right, their rear rear attack on him. Okay. Just a bad spot. Oh, there we go. Finally, we're getting a hit chance with something. Come on, guys. Can you do something against this guy? All right, we got heats up on him. This is where things get interesting. All right, say hello to my toasty friend. Have some heat. Now, he should not be firing anymore. Oh, blew up at a heat sink. Yeah, let's go rate, rate of fire here. Let's try to take him out. Crit on the engine heat sinks now. Nice. And we've got him on the ground. Perfect. Center torso it is. There we go. That's it. Just what we needed. Get him down, and we are ready to go. So let's get to picking some 
interesting salvage. I don't know what's going to be on the board here. Oh, we've got two AC-20s, light PPC, ERME MML-7, plasma cannon, yeah. Prototype, doubles, a Solaris cage. All right, we'll take the plasma ammo. And I think the rest of it's just money grab. Let's drop that one and take the light engine. Uh, let's drop that one and take the light and Or do we take the MML-7? I think we're going to take the MML-7, and we'll drop the other core, and we'll take the Pirate SRM-4. Uh, this is against overheating. All right, let's take the lead engine and confirm that. Get the ER mediums. I don't want machine gun arrays. Don't want the SRMs. The core was a money grab, so was the engine. Hmm, this is interesting. That's a prototype doubles, Solaris cage. Let's see, this is cockpit. Double bin of AMS ammo. All right, that's a decent salvage. Not great, not bad, but we didn't take too much damage either. So, looks good. What can we do next? Well, the question is, are we replacing the SRM with the MML? Oh, that's beautiful. <laughs> no problem. Let's take a look at that real quick. Look at the Kentaro. Now, the Holly is three tons. The MML-7 is four and a half. I'm thinking no. Yes. I'm thinking yes. The AMS was mostly just a filler. This is really where I want to go with it. Let's see. Well, we can put the Solaris cage in here. Extra guts. Hey, we've got it. Let's use it, right? Proto doubles. Okay. Yeah, it's... I didn't think it was, I think we needed a proto heats and kit to go with it. All right, I like that. We'll take the two days to repair it. Everything will be wonderful. And let's leave it at that. I hope everybody enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a like. I appreciate it, it helps me out. If you'd like to see more, subscribe. And we'll see you in the next one. Have a great day, everybody.